Dictionaries are one of the most underutilized aspects of programming, so today I wanted to talk about their use case and power. First, let's compare them to arrays. Arrays are like a shelf full of boxes, and in each box is an element of your array. If you don't inherently know which box the item you're looking for is in, you have the potential to look through each box to find the item you're looking for. In big O notation terms, this is what we'd call an O of N. Big O notation is a way of calculating how fast your program is. Now, dictionaries are extremely similar. We still have our shelf full of boxes. However, this time we put labels on each box, meaning we can quickly access the item we want on the first try. In big O notation terms, this would be an O of 1. Now let's look at dictionary implementation. We're going to have to define a variable, but then we're going to do something weird and follow it with some curly braces. Here's where we're going to add values at runtime. We're able to give our key value, which is like the label on the box, and then give it the actual value we want the box to contain. We then have a comma to separate values. We can then access our dictionary by putting our key value in between some square brackets. This will return the value. We can also extend our dictionary by using the same method, but assigning the value we want to it with the key we want. That's all for this video. If you got anything from this, I'd greatly appreciate a like. Thanks, guys.